Hi, the guys at Drobo here, talking about VMware and shared storage. So Matt, when it comes to shared storage, what are the advantages that someone would get by deploying a Drobo in a VMware environment? Sure, for existing VMware users, it's a great way to make the leap from local storage to shared storage to be able to take advantage of both vMotion or vStorage. And for new customers of VMware, it's a great way to lay the foundation so as their VMware infrastructure grows, they can uh, easily add additional hypervisors. So Eric, there's a lot that's built into a Drobo. What are some of the things that are built in that provide advantages in a virtualized environment like VMware? Well, if you're virtualizing for the first time, Drobo's are very easy to use, so it, it allows you to focus on a lot of the other things other than storage when deploying your, yeah. your first vSphere cluster. But also, uh, we built in dataware tiering technology into the Drobo, which allows you to have both capacity and performance, allowing you to use hard disk drives and SSDs right alongside each other in a solution that is affordable and not you know $50,000 plus. Uh, to get into. Yeah, and on our live chat, you know, we all know talking to lots of folks that have questions, they need a lot of capacity, but they also need, with that consolidation on a storage device, the I.O. performance they may not have had before. And so rather than going with those 15K drives they'd classically try to use, which would rob them of capacity, now they can get both uh, capacity and performance, which right. is great. For more information on this solution and to get access to our detailed how-to guide for deploying Drobo in a VMware environment, go to drobo.com slash solutions for more.